Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, this is Excelus, and welcome back to another episode of Horizon Zero Dawn. So we're continuing our progress in the main quest. Uh, I know there are a lot of side quests I haven't done yet, but uh, I really want to know what happens here. Besides, uh, this is a rune that we haven't discovered yet. And uh, I think this is, will be the last in main quest I will do before clearing out all the side quests we still have uh, that we ignored so far. So, uh, that said, uh, I already got over here while exploring because I wanted this vantage point, okay? So basically what you need to know, I'm not sure if we're going to relive that cutscene. When you get all the way up here to the mountain, there is a cutscene where there's a storm bird that attacks you. Nothing new, and re just a regular storm bird that will attack you, you finish it, it's like the thunder jaw. Uh, basically a big monster is coming, he's not happy you're here, and uh, he wants to kill you. So I'm not sure we're going to face this again, but uh, it's nothing, nothing fancy. You've already seen me facing a Stormbird before. Uh, okay, so we're close by. There's no safe point closer to this rune. So here's what we're going to do. Uh, let me call a horse. Or a ride. Where's my ride? Okay, I think we, if I remember right, there's a place we can climb from here. Air, here it is. Okay, let's go. One, two, three, four, and five. This is where we'll get intense, like it's getting colder and colder the more you climb. Uh, here. Okay. Okay. So, are we going to get gonna get the same cutscene we got last time? Apparently not. This is where, as soon as you land here, there's a cutscene that the Stormbird will attack you. Nothing fancy. But anyway, this will save us time for the recording. Uh, let me get the horse. And get this on the way. Thank you. How about this? Almost there. Gaia Prime. Do you think we're going to face Hades in this place? Or... Are there more quests to do after that? I hope so. I really love this game. I loved it so far. And I'm pretty ha I'm... Oh. Okay. Guy's sacrifice. I did this. Cracked the inside of the mountain like it was an egg. Okay. Yes, yes. Quickly now. I prepared the way ahead for you. Uh huh. So you've been in here before. To a point. You'll see. Okay. Uh, climb up the outcrop. That's what you're about to do. You made a climbing path for me, but left an army of machines for me to deal with. Since when were machines any obstacle for you? If you could fly, I wouldn't have bothered with a climbing path either. Huh. So he made it climbable, that's what I did. Uh where are we supposed to go? I'm pretty sure you can climb this. No? Okay, no. This is down. Oh down. Are you serious? This is where you are being uh afraid of heights. Dude, it's just Uh, up or down now? Uh. 
Okay. Um, let's go in. Gaia Prime. There we go. This is exactly the kind of place I expected to find you in silence. Thank you. It's one of many workshops I've constructed over the years. <laughs> Hi, dude. For years, I tried to get through this hatch. I drilled, I burned, I blasted. But we both know that you won't have any trouble getting through. You make it sound like I should apologize. Not at all. It never occurred to me that the way through would not be with force, but with a key. A key in human form. The failure of imagination was mine, not yours. Okay, when did you come here? It looks like you've spent a lot of time here. Nineteen years ago, a great explosion destroyed this mountain. Guy's death. Your birth. The echo could be heard as far as the claim. Ash darkened the skies. How they fretted in meridian as they tried to read this omen. Hmm. The crater burned for weeks, but when it cooled, I was the first to behold what lay within. Over time, the machines closed ranks to protect it. Useful. Soon, no one dared to come here. Except me. That's starting to make sense. Uh, why aren't you here? I thought you might actually be here this time. Actually, here. <laughs> why? My presence is unnecessary. You don't need my help to pass through this door. You were the one born to do this, not me. Besides, where are his eyes? Repairing Gaia? In her message, Gaia said we could restore her, but... After seeing the damage... How could that be? She said any effort to repair her must come after Hades is destroyed. I concur. Rebuilding the terraforming system now might allow Hades to use it as a weapon. Because of Gaia's sacrifice, it has been forced to search for means that are less... convenient. Okay. But do you think it's even possible to restore Gaia? You know what the cauldrons are capable of. How they fabricate any technology necessary to create a machine. By the same principle, it should be possible to replicate every technology necessary to repair Gaia. But that would take years. We're counting the time we have left by the hour. Okay, I'm going in then. It's time for me to head in. Okay! Yes. When you find the Master Override, you will gain the power to defeat Hades. Everything depends on you. We'll see about that. Anything else I can grab in here? Yes. Uh, I need nothing. to get going. So what can we grab around here? Nothing? Uh, doesn't seem like it. But anyway, let us open this uh, activate screen. Genetic identity confirmed. Entry authorized. And Thursday. Greetings, Dr. Sobek. Time for panda juice. You are clear to proceed. Okay, let's go. This is orange juice, actually. <laughs> uh, here or here? Maybe we'll miss on something if we don't go here. What is that? See, see, see. There's the. Ooh, what's that? Logging arrivals. Shan Margo. Welcome to Frozen Hell. Population ten. Eleven, counting Gaia. Don't count your chicken embryos before they incubated, hon. She's still firing up. There were eleven only alive. I'm vegan, Travis. You'd think we'd worked in the same secret base long enough for you to notice. We weren't scheduled to shack up here for another three weeks. You realize I just lost 350 kilos of pre-code smug comics in transit. Wait, actual physical media? Why didn't you have it digitized? Can't beat the feel of physical media on your fingers. Even a post post a year, we ain't gonna be touching a whole lot else. Paper. I knew I was gonna pass the time archiving them. What about you? Me? 
work, I guess. My task queue stretches out for like three years. There's a lot of sharp edges to round off after that. Mm, I hadn't so. really thought about it. Oh, you will. You what? 30? Rick, can you be the one turning the lights off at the end? Food for thought, huh, vegan? This sucks forever. Nah, not forever. Okay. Just the rest of your life. Let us go. What's in here? Oh, ho, 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 ho. there's something going on in here. Do you hear that? Do you actually hear that, guys? Why is this uh, so low? Sorry about that. Okay, uh... We need to go to the... Le well, yeah, yeah, ripple down. Uh, okay, what's in here? Is there anything that we might miss in here? Guess that's my way across. Seems like it. But, uh,. Oh, there is nothing, I guess. I should we should just go. How about this? Whoa, whoa! Man, you need to be brave to do that. It's uh held like this for nineteen years, right? Well D don't answer. <laughs> oh my god. All the way there. Oh, glad that's over. Uh, okay, let me go straight. If it's possible, that is. Oh, what's in there? No? Nothing? Okay, here. Drop to ledge. Uh, no, please. Okay, here. Okay. Go. What's in here? Myself, 
to a quiet planet, a barren sphere. Ah, they have no Gaia and her long, long dreaming. I hope she won't be lonely. Okay, next one. Evacuation happens so fast. No time to think things through. No time for goodbyes. There were lines in the medical ward. I told Tom Pake I'd be with him when he went under. But there was one last shipment of parody Saiyadi zygotes I could get processed if I rushed. I'm still angry at him for forcing me to choose. Angry at myself for... Well, he died alone. And I didn't get the bloody birds of paradise saved either. Elizabeth's room. Oh. I know it. She didn't even get a chance to unpack. These are her journals. Elizabeth's journals. And they're all destroyed? Scan them. The focus can rebuild them, but the process is slow. Sell back journal. File damage and the repair. Us, it seems a powerful device, but its engine is tiny and limited. How slow? Days, weeks, years. Concern yourself with stopping Hades and extending the future, and you might live long enough to hear them. Anything else we can... Is there anything else we need to scan? How about here? Whoa. What is this? I need to use this, right? Let me try. This is Charles Rodson. I'm logging this six hours after final deployment of Gaia Prime. This morning, an access port seal malfunctioned. Gaia Prime's port seals were designed to close with a seam of less than two millimeters. But this one closed with a 10 millimeter gap. Enough for an energy signature to bleed through. Enough for the swarm to detect this facility. Enough for Gaia to be discovered and destroyed. Enough to end the future we worked so hard to make possible. Unless the hatch servos were manually re-engaged from the outside. I'm now switching to a recording of the event. Well, I'm not going out there. Now who would I have signed up for? Either we sent someone out or all of this was for nothing. It should be Liz's decision. So when is she going to get here? She said five minutes. These are the founders of the program, right? Think. Oh no. Okay, everyone. I've repaired the seal. Gaia? Seal closure at 1.4 millimeters. Confirmed. Elizabeth, no. We'll find a way to bring you back in. It's not gonna happen. The swarm's too close. Really. It's alright. Gaia's complete. She'll take care of things from here on out. That's what she does. Not like this. There's so much we... Guys, you know me. I'm... I'm no good endings. At letting things end, so, um... Let's not. So... Happy trails, Liz. And... Uh, <laughs> see you around. Yeah. The end of humanity of as we right? know it. Liz.
Bam! Let me analyze this. You'd hate it, Liz, but I wrote you a eulogy. If I had to try to express all your children, after all Apollo has taught them, they'll think they know everything. But they have to understand what you did for them. How you loved the whole world so much. With an intensity that was dazzling. Hell, Liz. I know. I know you're never gonna hear this. That's not the point. You, uh... <laughs> you got to play the savior in the motor all at once this time. Great work. Liz, you are a pretty stand-up gal. I'm sorry you died. If you had a home to go to, I hope you got there first. But this monument Ronson's made to you? Kinda creepy if you ask me. Rest in peace, Liz. God knows you earned it. Nice. Okay, talk to Simon. She's gone. Really gone. You knew she couldn't have survived, Aloy. And her achievements were... beyond exceptional. While her people bickered, she was the one who took responsibility. The only one who could. She was better than them. That's not what I said. She was. You shouldn't be afraid to admit it. Stop acting like a machine. You just don't get it. Nothing the way you mean. <laughs> uh, nothing the way you mean. You think she was better because she was smart. Because she designed Zero Dawn, but you missed the point. What made her great was that she was willing to sacrifice herself for others, for everyone who would come later. No. She couldn't let her creation fail. You're confusing will for sentimentality. You're wrong. Remember, she knew it wasn't enough for Gaia to think. She taught Gaia to feel. To care, to sacrifice, to believe in life. Enough to fight against hopelessness. If it wasn't for that sentimentality, life would have ended. You and I would never have existed. Your argument is sound. I'm sorry for your... loss. I'm starting to, to wonder to if uh, silence is not a cyborg, actually. Maybe. What? Nothing. It's time to go on. He's really uh, cold-hearted, <laughs> to be honest. He thinks he really thinks like a machine. Pragmatic, maybe. <coughs> Hello, Margo. How are you holding up? Uh, Dr. Ronson, I've been getting a lot of messages, unsolicited messages from Ted. Um, anything else, oh, God, actually, I'm in sorry. this place? With Liz gone, we've got no one to run interference with him. I'll talk to Ted. He mostly wants updates, constant updates, hundreds of updates on things he knows nothing about. Liz used to field all of his crap. He doesn't understand the systems at all. I was kind of by design. But he's getting pretty sketchy with me. We just have to keep him happy. Liz always said, keep him happy. Why are we gonna plug into their heads, Liz? A whole lot of history. A whole lot of so-called truth. A whole, a whole lot of noise. It's not tablet, Liz. It's poison. Hey, okay, uh, what will happen now? Are we facing anything in this book? place yeah, so far it's a lot of history which I don't mind there's another section at the back of the crater looks like it survived the blast because it was armored you found the control room I'm on my way That's what I thought. There's something coming. 
Shut the controller now. Whoa. I thought there was something there. Oh my god. Wait, wait, wait. Dude. Okay, good. Uh, what's that? Supposed to go. Uh, it's all the way up there, but <gasps> oh. Ho, ho, ho. Okay. What? Seriously? Let's go up there. That's over there. But uh, let me check here first. <sighs> okay. Kill them? Or what did, what happened here? When I opened the hatch, the air rushed in from this side. Because there was none inside the chamber. But the alphas were in there. Somebody killed them. That's for sure. Maybe Hades? Or something killed them. Let me check. Come on. out of court control. Alpha clearance overridden. What the hell is Omega clearance? Oh no. Alpha personnel. Sorry to alarm you, but I need you to listen, okay? To what I'm about to say. This isn't easy. See, uh, I've, uh, please stop trying to access the system, okay? See, see what this is about is um i said stop trying to access the goddamn system and wh what i'm trying to say is i can't stop thinking about the ones who come after us those innocents those blameless men and and and, and women we're gonna give them knowledge like it's a gift ted ted we've talked about this before Apollo has 3,000 plus fail-safe conditions. It's not a gift, it's a disease. They're the cure, and we're gonna give them the disease. Our disease? No, we can't. And it's not too late. If we're willing to sacrifice. Ted, it doesn't need to be like this. It already is, Samina. I did it three minutes ago. I've purged Apollo. It's gone. All of it. Every copy. A sacrifice? It's not a sacrifice. It's cultural obliteration, you crazy bastard. Millennia of culture. I'm sorry. Really, I am. But sometimes... Wow. They sent us to the Innocence Stone Age. To die. This guy sent us to the Stone Age. And he killed them all. Dude, seriously. He is seriously messed up. Oh, that pisses me off. He, he killed them all. So this is why 
This is why we were trapped in benighted ignorance for an innocent future. Blameless men. <sighs> he never saw the slaughter in the sun ring. Everything these people achieved, all the knowledge of the old ones, he evaporated, turned to dust. Ah, that pisses Skeleton. me off. <laughs> like the it's a good thing it's a game. No. Not a void. When the hatch unsealed and scattered their ashes on the wind, it took them out among the world they made. The world we are living in. It's... It's a monument to what they died trying to accomplish. A monument to oblivion. Not oblivion, silence. Oh, dude. Claim the master override. Here we go. The master override? That's so small. Now all you have to do is kill Hades with it. That's a lot of take in, guys. Return to Silence Workshop. Here we go. Alright, this is a room I missed last time, so. Oh, these are a lot of supplies. Are they preparing us for a fight? Where to now? Okay, there. Apparently. Are we going here? Good. Okay, Try there's definitely stuff. Death. The master override doesn't override gravity. Keep holding, uh, keep holding. Okay. Should climb here. Where are we supposed to go? In there. Okay. There. journey together has come to an end, Aloy. But before I go, I think I owe it to you to tell you the rest of the story. Go on. Some time ago, I admitted that I'd been involved with the Eclipse. But I never told you the full extent of my culpability. He's the, the truth one. is, I was there at the beginning. I found Hades, Aloy, buried on that mountain, trapped in that shattered titan. And I served it. What? It promised knowledge and delivered such knowledge. You have no idea. And in exchange? I helped create the Eclipse. Helped it build a cult, an army to do its will. Why are you telling me this now? Because your success depends on knowing this. When I found Hades, the first thing it wanted to know about was the Spire, not Meridian, the Spire. Now why would that be? The Spire was created by Gaia. Which part of Gaia? M Minerva, its code-breaking module. Gaia built spires to transmit the codes that deactivated the Pharaoh robots, shut down their biomatter conversion systems. Mm. Hades wants to send a new transmission to wake the machines so they can devour the world all over again. Yes. Based on what we've learned, that's my conclusion as well. So the Eclipse, the robots they've resurrected, they're just a means to an end, an army to capture the Spire. Yes. So Hades can exterminate life all over again, unless you stop it. Tell me everything about you I and Hades. I want you to tell me everything. Hades, the Eclipse, everything. It's a long story, Aloy. Then get started. It began with a focus. 
recovered from an ancient ruin, as yours was so many years ago. Mm. In my case, the device was heavily damaged. There was just a flicker of life in it. I spent weeks studying it, attempting repairs, until finally, I succeeded. A whole new dimension of perception revealed, right before my eyes. That's when I detected it. A faint signal. Out there, something was searching, just like I was. A real kindred spirit. I followed the signal to its source. A shattered titan, buried in the jungles of the jewel. Hades. So you thought it was a titan? An old war machine? I didn't know what to think. I'd seen such wreckage before. The Grave Horde, for example. But this was different. This was not quite dead. It couldn't speak when I found it. Until my repairs gave it a voice. So began an exchange of knowledge. It wanted to know everything about our world, its tribes and machines. But the Spire was always its foremost concern. What did it want to know about the Spire? Its precise location. The surrounding geography. Who controlled the land. Meanwhile, Hades revealed to me many of the intricacies of ancient technology. It bid me to recover and repair more focuses. Before long, I had a couple dozen up and running. <laughs> Enough to equip a small army. The commanders of one, anyway. I didn't care. I was learning so much. Physics, calculus. You have no idea. Why the Karja? And the Shadow Karja? How did they become involved? The Karja Civil War was a happy coincidence. <sighs> a perfect opportunity. <laughs> An opportunity? That's what it was to you? Yes. Overnight, half the tribe was in exile, desperate to win back Holy Meridian. Their religion made them easy to manipulate. All I had to do was present Hades as the buried shadow of their mythology. So yes, it was an opportunity. I arranged for High Priest Bahavas to meet with Hades. Helis was there as well. And so the Eclipse was born. Anything to win back Holy Meridian. Neither of you cared about Meridian. But Hades didn't care about Meridian. And neither did you. We live in a world of fallen cities and vanished tribes. What were a few more? Besides, I was too busy setting up the cult's focus network to Hades specifications. A thrilling technical challenge, especially with the alterations I included of my own design. <laughs> the ability for you to spy on them. Yes. I may have been foolish enough to serve Hades. But I was never so foolish that I trusted it. I installed what the ancients used to call a back door in the network. Huh. Secret access, empowering me to monitor all activity and communications. Why did you betray what them? What made you turn on Hades? It certainly wasn't your conscience. Actually, I was troubled the first time I saw the Eclipse raise an ancient war robot. With my technology. I questioned Hades about its intentions. A little late. Indeed. I'd already outlived my usefulness. When I completed work on the Focus Network, Hades summoned me to receive my reward. The next moment, I heard it broadcast my kill order. I've been a fugitive ever since. When did you find out? So when did I come into this? Our path together? When Olin stumbled on you. System threat detected. That got my attention. A kill order against a savage Nora girl? Why would Hades bother with that? But then I saw that this Nora girl was wearing a focus and bore an uncanny resemblance to a great scientist of the old world. Helis moved quickly. I thought you were dead. But then I detected your focus inside the Nora mountain. The more I observed you, the more convinced I became of your extraordinary nature. And usefulness. Through you, 
I could finally discover the secrets of the Earth. I vowed to do everything I could to ensure your success. The rest, as they used to say, is history. Is there nothing you want to do for knowledge you've done? With You've done what you could to make up for your mistakes. Is there a... I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure it's not his fault, to be honest. Uh, he trusted it to a point, and then he wanted to make up for it. So I'm going to... With the, this You've done terrible option. things, Silence. But you've also done what you could to undo them. I can't say you've balanced the scale, but at least you've tried. To be clear, Aloy, I would do it all again. A few more safeguards, perhaps. But basically the same. Really? So much for learning from mistakes. I've done all I can. From here on out, the rest is up to you. Take my lance. Fit the master override to it, and you have a means of injection. Then I just need to get close enough to Hades' skull to stab it in? Exactly. Oh, no problem. Silence! Where will you go? Elsewhere. And everywhere. There's so much more to discover before the world ends. And all this? I leave it to you, of course. As it turned out, it was yours all along. There's a hint of jealousy. Trespassing. Well, he did, he did save her. She wouldn't have gotten that far without his help. The lens. Uh, wait, what is that? I traveled far to find you. I heard your transmission. It was you, wasn't it? That's funny. Entity is not known. I'm called Silence, and you are. Wow. I don't think you'd have called out if it wasn't something you wanted. You called, I responded. Tell me your name. Hades. You are a creation of the ancients. A war machine. Divine timeline. Time? Ah. It is the 13th king of the Karja Sultan's reign. Divine Karja. We're getting ahead of ourselves. Were you created by the ancients? I wonder how long you waited here, buried, until I chanced upon you. How long you'd have to wait for another. You're obviously very powerful. But you're not going to get anywhere without me. <laughs> Titan Flame merely houses intellect. Define Karja. Now that's more like it. Wow. They're coming. Preparations are complete. Ah, Lucent Bahamas. Behold. As I promised you. What? Manner of great machine is this? I've never seen such a thing. Stay! Stay your ground, Karja in shadow! Incorrect. Bow before the buried shadow. Damn, man. Buried shadow, I... I don't understand. Did Araman understand the Glint Hawk? That perch upon the alight. It speaks scripture. Araman followed the shadow cast from the spire. Whoa, the Mesa, he's really good. Well, he's an author. You will follow the shadow once more. I am a righteous man, chosen of the sun. But in times of need, the powers of shadow can accomplish what the sun alone cannot. Will. Will you return to us what is ours, O oh, Shadow of Prophecy? An army is required. Obey and 
Meridian is yours. Of our obedience, you can be certain. Oh my god. <laughs> Trail just here. Helis. Threat detected inside Eclipse. Speak its name, O Shadow, and it will die. You will eliminate this one. Silence. Silence. Yes. A truth whispered at night is seen in the day. He was never one of us. It will be done. Oh, for God's sake. Okay, the lance now. A new spear, huh? Wow. <laughs> A silence lance. Okay, guys, we are done. And there's a new main quest, which is perfect because ready to strike. After what happened with Derval, I know he'll defend the city with the spire. I will finish the side quest I have still to do. Apparently we have a new spear, which is better than the old one. Oh my god, and we can actually uh this is better, right? Um, but uh, how are we supposed to equip anything? Uh, in any case, any case, in any case, um, we're going to stop the recording just here, guys. And that will be all guys for today, thank you so much for watching. If you like what you saw, please share the video with your friends, comment, like, subscribe. This helps me a lot, more than you know. Really, it helps out. Please give it some time. And if you want to see my future videos or my past videos, you can follow me on one of the social media. The details are running here in the back. You can also find the links in the description down below. Again, no excuses. Give it some time right now. Go, 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 go. Till next time, guys. Take care of yourselves and each other. Please stay safe and see you guys next time. Bye.